GG baby. G -G. Hey, G -G. G -G. Welcome to the Am Theory. My name is Peter Poppy Vasquez. Welcome to the Am Theory. My name is Scott. Snames. Bad boy Bobby Boucher. Bobby Boucher. My Boucher. name is GG. Actually, it's J Mac. So this is a very special day. Yes. Very special day. Because we're going back For us. A, to a previous generation. To a, a generation of yesteryear. To a. A girl's generation. That's what I was trying to lead you. I know, I, but you know. He was also going to say second generation, I think. Yeah. I was going to let you say it. Was, it was, was too go, obvious. I was going to let you go through the, the generation. But golly gee. <laughs> this, this isn't the remastered. This this one has 3.1. Wait. Bro, that's oh, the subscribers. Are you? Hey, you know I'm what? really excited <laughs> for this group. Let, let me take this in. Because let, let it, me stop you wow. it's been heavily requested. Welcome to the Ant Theory, where Peter usually doesn't bring in videos. I was just going to let him do his thing. No, hey, this is why I important. usually bring in videos. We did a poll on our last live, and we asked, hey, between Girls' Generation and Treasure, what do you they guys want? And may, Girls, they may not yeah. have been. Yeah, you were. So you were there. Hey, look. Is this your first time like connecting with us and watching a video of us being dumb? It only goes downhill from here. And then we react. And then we actually like bring it back. Like it comes full circle. It's a circle. A circle that goes round and round. Just I'm like just sitting here watching the wheels go round and round. I really like to watch those. Anyways. So Girls' Generation <laughs> won our poll, and so we're picking the, the oh, no, most no, no, no. viewed video because this is our first foray into Girls' Generation. Yeah. And this is G. 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 Are you a G? I'm a G. I'm from G-Town. Ooh. <laughs> he said that's so white. <laughs> He's like, I'm from G-Town. Garland, Texas area. Maybe you should just press play. <laughs> I'm, you are not allowed back in my, my G Town premises. <laughs> Girls' Generation G, I appreciate you stopping by today. Let's check this out. Those aren't real mannequins. What gave them away? They don't have parts for their connection. Hey. This is originally 2009. You got no like I, I like the G G G. Okay, I, I, okay, I can okay. see it already. It is so weird too, like because like the styles are like so of the times. Like we've been reacting to K-pop. I was like, like, bro, flash, years. flash me back yeah. to right out of high school, like it, early, it's, yeah, so, late night, late teens, early twenties. I'm like, yeah. this, oh, I, everybody looked like this. 2009, everybody dressed like this. 2009, I, I just turned 21, been graduated high school for three years. Ooh. But like, like their their styles are just like so. That time it's like jumping into a time capsule. I love it. All uh, right, uh, I like the drum beat. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. They, it started like I'm like, oh, that it's immediately. Yeah, catchy. that's about to be in my head all week already. Is that like a swing beat? Like... Oh. I can see you doing that, bro.
Yo, that drum beat is yeah. going ham. Yeah. It's legit like a flashback. Yeah. Uh, the, the style and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm like, oh, man. The, you, Take you, me back. You, you talked about the drums. I said it was like a, sw- like, it had like a little swing to it, but like now I'm thinking like the old hardcore days at like the, the, the two step part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, Somebody's like, definitely hitting that, that double, that double <laughs> kick bass right yeah. there. That, yeah, it's like that, it's like that, the, 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 the two step. That was very yeah. prevalent in hardcore music. Yeah. Like the, the two step part makes me want to dance. It, yeah. it sounds like it has, it has to be that, but that, man, that, I can see why. Like, obviously, like, no, I don't know if this is like, was this their debut hit? This is 13 years ago, yeah. obviously, but was like, this was their first hit, was it? I don't know. That's what we, I don't know. I don't know anything about Girls' Generation except how hyped they are and how they yeah. were such a big pillar of the second generation of K pop. Yeah. So, well. I will say that this is going into my uh, guilty pleasure box. One hundred percent. I was feeling the same you're day. Try, you're trying hard to not like it. Yeah, I can yeah. tell. You're trying. No, I'm not. I'm not trying but, not to like it. I'm just trying not to you're like. Trying it. Trying to hold much. back, hold back the dance. So, so Peter, Peter is a stoic, and Peter is very much trying to act very stoic right now, and not show how much he's liking this. I keep yeah. my emotions inside. But as soon as like that, chee 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 chee, baby, baby, baby. That's my favorite part. That's, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> How many are there? There's a lot in, in like the ten group, too. It might be ten. Kind of like that Toy Story. That it's, it's kind of like the story. It's like the mannequins. There's nine. There's nine. Oh, that's close. Yeah. It's like unless the screen's cutting off. Mannequins by day, and then when nobody's watching, they're alive. Just talking about that eighties. Yeah, movie? yeah, I could, I kind of. Mannequin. I think I think that's the the vibe of it because mm-hmm. it was like yeah. after hours. Like yeah. yeah. If only Michael McCarthy was uh was there to like take care of the mannequins. Yeah. I thought you said Mike McCarthy. I'm like, he can't even take care of our offense. Then you can take Michael care of you can care of some mannequins. Correct me if I'm wrong. It's Michael McCarthy who was in the 80s movie Mannequin with, uh, what's the girl from Sex in the City? Nobody watched that. It's Chris Play. Actually, they might have. And what was the girl from s- the, the old one? Not the old one. Wow. Uh, Carrie? Not Kim Cattrall? Jessica. That one. Kim Cattrall. Kim Cattrall was in the first mannequin. Oh, we know our sex in the city. <coughs> yeah, we know Where our demographic. You? Bitch, what do you know? Where were you when HBO was hot? Yeah, bro. I was, rich, I was uh, real sex and then sex in the city. Oh, well, y'all were, we're not going to climb on that one? Yeah, yeah, you ain't going to be real with me? Act like you didn't watch that shit what? together? Taxi well, Cab. Well, y'all were Taxi Cab Confessions. That's a nice little, little high note. Is it what? Is it what? Oh, he think he cute. <laughs> <laughs> He's extra feeling this stuff. Oh, he did. He's cute. Shut your old bitch ass up. Hey, hey, no, hold up. I've seen that look. That was beautiful. No, I've seen that look. That was. 
his, so pretty... his high school crush signed his yearbook uh-huh. and said like heart K I T. Here's my number. And Peter's like, yeah, you know, you know. This. I'm out here trying to. I'm out here trying to catch them all. You know how I do. <laughs> no, but hey, <laughs> I'm very surprised. Honestly, it, I was expecting to not like this. Really? I was preparing myself. I was like. Probably not gonna be my style, but you know what? It's gonna go right next to uh, Miley Cyrus' party in the USA in my guilty pleasure mm. uh, treasure trove. Oh, that's I'm a good that that, away. Okay, this I wouldn't even say it's like a guilty pleasure song because it was it was fun. I'm not, I, I I couldn't bump it in the streets, but yeah, I, I, I could bump this at home. I like it. This yeah, is this, this is lit, bro. What yeah. would, okay, they're talking about in the comments. They're talking about how, this song is iconic, by the way, in K-pop history. Really? So Cheat. Well, I could tell why. I mean, it's good. It's a good song. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. And good. Girls' Generation in general is iconic. Too. Shout out there, would, there, would, there would be no K-pop without Girls' Generation. Too. Is the is this a guilty pleasure song for you, or is this like a I'm gonna turn this shit up loud in the parking lot? See, I'm comfortable with my masculinity where it's not a guilty pleasure song. It just goes on my playlist. Uh, what, well, we okay, barely what, have some. What is a guilty pleasure song for you? Dua Lipa. Aren't you the guy who That's a good song. To yeah. Oh, okay. oh wow. Okay. This is my shit. I love, I love Dua Lipa. That's my wife from another life. But anyways, wife from another life? hey, I guess Girl's so. Generation is... That's fire, bro. Yeah. He's like, hey, let let us know what what's what's the best recommendations. I mean, we did the one that's most viewed, but yeah, there's a lot of maybe that's not like the most dopest shit. It's like, oh, but wait until they came out with this. Yeah, yeah. You know? put put us uh, put us on game. Let us They're know. like they fucked the streets up with this one over here. <laughs> <laughs> you never know, bro. You never know. Hearts were breaking wide open tonight with this song. Yeah, hey, you never Dang. know. But hey, that, that I'm hooked right now. Yeah, it was G good. got me. You got me hooked. GG. Hey, GG. That's also a gamer term. GG, good game. Hey, this was G'd up from the feet up. <sighs> G, this was a good song. <laughs> this made me want to. Wow. I'm done. Thanks, guys. Put the people on top of me now. Yeah. You see these people? <laughs> <laughs> that's why we put people on top of Pick Peter because he says some wild shit that I have to cut that's out. A, so that's, that's why you got that weird cut there. But those amazing people are part of our no breaks <laughs> tier on Patreon. <laughs> L- listen to me, but focus on them, but and focus on the names. But we uh, have all kinds of tiers over on Patreon. But if you want to support tiers. the channel, that's the best way to do it. And the uh, the real best way is just by liking and subscribing and commenting below what your favorite Girls Generation song is. Give us, learn us some knowledge about Girls' Generation and tell us which ones we need to react to next because Girls' Generation and there are, will definitely be coming back because th- I were, need more of that. Yeah, there were there are quite a few uh, members if they've got any solo work. Maybe uh, maybe we can check that out too. Yeah, yeah for sure. Maybe. So drop all that down below. Maybe. Like, share, subscribe. Come to our lives. Come to our birthday on the 15th. It's going to be a lot of fun. 315. Uh, that's where we you, we got this oh. recommendation. was from oh, our line. You guys voted this, and it won. So, Girls' Generation is some fire stuff. So, come to our lives. That's that's where we get all the, the wild and crazy stuff. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Popping off. At, it's uh, so crazy over there. Know, it's I mean, chaotic. It's not it's really so crazy. Chaotic. I'm kind of overhyping it, but... It gets crazy. It's so bad. It's so pretty crazy. Thing. Actually, I mean, I mean, been go, back, go back cupcakes. a couple weeks ago. Peter dropped that entire shelf behind him. What is he it? dropped a cake, a cupcake. He kicked it out of my and hand. And before we started recording today, it's got knocked over a photo. On the Sorry, board. cat. I think I have to re- <laughs> rethink this setup. But yeah, anyways, you guys are crazy. We love you guys. We <laughs> so appreciate crazy. you stopping by, and we'll catch you on, on the, the next, next one. one. Try again.